Hi guys, welcome back. So, um, usually anymore I've been trying to have a full face of makeup on when I do my videos, but I just done my skincare routine with the with stri with the Strivectin um, 114 technology, the Neo 114, and um, I come out to find this. So. I originally sent, or I, I, I had originally ordered um, a few things from the ne New Nectar collection by ColourPop, and um, I had actually did an opening unboxing video like I'm about to do right now, but I ended up scrapping it because everything arrived broken, and I was really very sad, and I ended up deleting the video. But I was smart enough to take photos of it and um, there's photos of the product and everything. I emailed ColourPop. I let them know what happened. Um, and granted, I emailed them, I think, on a Thursday or a Friday. So it was really close to the weekend and I didn't hear back almost immediately. But I kind of figured out what happened because it's the weekend. And really only retail and... Um, hospital emergency and emergency rooms and urgent cares are really open on the weekends <laughs> anyway um so i sent them an email told them what happened they asked for you know the, the uh, confirmation of the payment information order number and uh, photos of the product as well as um the names of the super shock shadows that i had ordered now keep in mind this was the very first ColourPop order that I had made and I was very very saddened by it. So I emailed them and they they took care of me. Um, within a week of the original order arriving and getting the email thing all figured out, I have them again. Um, I'm not sure what to expect. Although, you know, and, and I did, in the email conversation, I did ask them, you know, so do I send back the uh, original product? And they said, no, we take full responsibility of, um, of, your, of, of your baby, of, of your ColourPop babies arriving the way they did. Go ahead and keep them. I said, okay, cool. So, yeah, I come out to my desk after doing my whole new skincare routine. I don't know how old you see. Hmm? A little bit of a breakout, but mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, so I am excited to say the least. So here we go. Okay, so this is a uh, order slip for the two broken shadows. Um, yeah, okay. Again with the lucky you poster or postcard and the thing that shows what they're all about. Now, originally when they sent these, they were in a box. Okay. These look so much better. Um, however, keep in mind that I did order a palette as well. Um, and the order slip does not have the palette in here. So, we've got the... The Flipper Super Shock Eyeshadow, all in one piece. This is nice. I like that very much. It's this one right here. 
the blurring isn't making it very easy. Um, I will send an email about the uh, about the palette. It was a four pan palette. Um, this one is the shade Going Rogue. I've heard people online saying Going Rouge, and I hate to be that person, but it is R O G U E is pronounced Rogue, not Rouge. If it was Rouge, it would be R O U. G E. But there's going rogue. Okay. Cool beans. So both of these shadows are in one piece. This is awesome. Um, I do wonder if um if there will be a replacement for the palette that arrived that was broken. Um another email will be will be sent because, you know, you want to have full, complete, unbroken product when you, when you order something. And that's what I was hoping for with these. Now, I do want to say thank you, ColourPop, for replacing these two shadows that arrived broken. Um... And uh, I do hope that there is a palette on the way as well. And I will insert, because I still have the pictures, um, I will insert pictures of what, of, of how these looked when they arrived. Um, if anything, I may just uh, try and find, um, Try and find a similar eyeshadow shade to put in there because I mean, three of the four shadows were intact. It was the lighter, it was the lighter shadow in that Nectar Collection palette that was broken. When I opened up the box, and you'll see the photo. When I opened up the box, instead of it being in its nice little home, it was over here so there's that um but yeah overall overall I'm very happy with with ColourPop's customer service I'm very um I'm very happy with how everything was expedited um I was expecting to wait a little bit longer to be honest but I didn't have to um, so yeah, that was cool. Um, you know, they, you know, they sent the same card that they sent in the original package, which, okay, cool. See, because when I first started seeing pictures of, um, these cutesy little postcards, I thought they were actually individual and handwritten and stuff, but... This is the same one that I got with the original order. So they're trying to personalize things, and I appreciate that. And I believe the um, I want to say the customer service person that I was emailing with. I want to say her name was Samantha. So um, Samantha from ColourPop, thank you very much for um, for taking care of my customer service needs. Um, I, I do work in retail, so I know how much it means to the customer as well as the retailer when something goes the way it's supposed to when you're trying to solve a problem that a customer has. So thank you for that. I do appreciate that very much. And um, yeah, I'm currently testing out, uh, or taking for a test drive really, um, a new eyeshadow palette that I picked up, um, I want to say on Saturday. So once I've done my full, um, my full review on that, I'm going to dive into these ColourPop shades that I have. So I am very excited. 
and we'll see how it goes. You know, there may be future orders from ColourPop, and I'm, I'm really excited. So, thank you everybody for stopping by. I do appreciate, um, I do appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, um, I'm actually on vacation from my main retail job for the next eight days. So there's going to be a lot of nothing done. Um, my Instagram feed won't be nearly as full with uh, makeup looks unless I'm working at the part-time retail job that I have, because I have two. And, um, and posts will be made when I do my makeup for those jobs. So, um, let's see. I think I'm going to try and go back and watch some more of the Wednesday Club. Uh, the Wednesday Club airs on Geek and Sundry's Twitch channel every Wednesday around noon. And it's, it's, yeah, it talks about comics. Um, so you have Talis and Jaffe, Amy Dallin, and Matt Keys, I believe. All three of them are really interesting people. We all know Talison from Geek and Sundry's Critical Role show. I, w okay, I won't go too far into that because I will make a video eventually about um, my geeky tendencies and because I'm just so happy about them. They make me so happy. They put such a big smile on my face. I will do a geekiness video for you all. Um, and I've also got other videos planned, like, um, you know, get to know me video, um, my husband slash best friend tag video, you know, cause I realized that my husband tag and my best friend tag are the same tag. So there are a lot of videos that I have planned and I finally have the time to do them. So thank you so much for stopping by and, um, I'll, I'll, I'll provide links for um, the original items that I ordered from ColourPop as well as um, anything that I would love to order from them in the future. Um, I will provide links below for the usual stuff. I can't really do links for this, the stuff that's on my face. Well, I can. Um, all the, the, the Strivectin products that I use today, I will link those below um, as well as my glasses. I will link those. Um, the shirt's so old, I don't even know they make it anymore. So I'm not going to worry about that. In the meantime, again, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you so much for watching. And I will hopefully see you in the next video. And hopefully there will be another video soon. Soon. Alright guys, 